What is up, YouTube? Fury here, bringing you guys a brand new video. And in today's video, I'm gonna be going over the divisions and what you get when you prestige them, when you max prestige them, and stuff like that. What's the perks of you know prestiging these and all that good stuff? But before we jump into the video, if you guys do enjoy, drop a like. If you guys are new, don't forget that subscribe button. Now let's jump right into the video. So as you guys know, there are five divisions in World War II: the Infantry, Airborne, Armored, Mountain, and Expeditionary. Now, obviously, each one of these has a perk, and you know they benefit you know certain guns and stuff like that so obviously the infantry something more used towards assault rifles the airborne more so uh for submachine guns armored for lmgs mountain for snipers expeditionary for the shotguns now each one has its perks and stuff like that but when you guys prestige them for the first time you guys get the svt 40 for the infantry the airborne you get the mp40 the armored you get the mg42 and the mountain you get the car 98 and last but not least the expeditionary you get the sawed off shotgun which is pretty cool so you guys can unlock these weapons they are locked as you guys can tell if you guys haven't uh prestiged them they're obviously locked for those certain classes and once you prestige it uh, you know each division once you get that unlocked um you know weapon for that division which is pretty cool i think it's you know a, an incentive to you know use different divisions use different weapons and stuff like that personally i don't snipe i don't use shotguns i barely use lmgs i'm gonna start using more lmgs but um you know it's a reason to start using snipers shotguns and stuff like that obviously it's a little annoying with the shotguns snipers get a little annoying and the lmgs i mean those are three classes that do get annoying but i mean it's it's nice that they give you an incentive to use those you know different weapons to level up the divisions now obviously you don't need to use those certain guns to level divisions you just have to have that division you can use an smg in say a armored division or a expeditionary division with a assault rifle it just depends obviously each one has its own perks and um stuff like that but obviously leveling these up will get you those locked weapons which is pretty cool another reason to prestige each one um just so you can get uh, you know unlock those weapons and stuff like that to use them now something that most people uh may or may not know a lot of people don't know that when you guys prestige each of the divisions four times four times is the max prestige you can get on a division each one of those you know max prestiges you get say if you uh you know max the infantry max the airborne whatever you get an epic variant of what you unlocked in prestige one for that um division so say if you get prestige four for the infantry you get an svt epic variant and uh, the airborne you get a epic mp40 Armored, you get an epic MG42. Mountain, you get an epic Car 98. And Expeditionary, you get an epic sawed off shotgun, which is pretty cool because you guys can get, you know, free epic weapons that way without actually using your supply drops and, you know, hoping to get something there. So if you guys do like the MP40 or you guys like the SVT, MG40, whatever, um, you guys can get the epic variants for that weapon when you guys prestige that division four times obviously it takes a little bit of time but honestly you can get prestige four on a division in not i'd say half a day honestly if you guys just keep playing it doesn't take too long to prestige a division and um actually max prestige might take a prestiging once won't take too long um you know but if you guys just stick to one division just keep gaming stuff like that it doesn't take that long to max the division which is pretty cool and something else that we just you know that was just announced today is you guys can get the nuke or the v2 rocket which is technically the nuke in world war ii if you guys um prestige each division at least once now that's what it says at least once it's not completely confirmed but i believe that is how you get the new v2 rocket which is pretty cool so you just gotta prestige each division at least once gives you another reason to start using some of these other divisions that you may not use like the mountain expeditionary or the uh, armored one unless you guys obviously use those weapons but i mean it gives you a reason to start using those divisions which is pretty cool now if you guys do i mean i'm it's something i'm gonna be going for obviously right now i'm working on armored which is and you know why i mentioned i would start using the lmgs a little more um i started using armored um about to prestige that i prestige infantry airborne now i just got to prestige the mountain and expeditionary obviously those are the two that i'm kind of holding off on because i don't want that i don't want to unlock them or you know use those divisions because they don't help that much using smgs or ars or stuff like that but obviously i'm gonna start using those just so i can get that v2 rocket get you guys some new gameplays and stuff like that like we did obviously in a or iw i should say um that's honestly what i'm focusing on 
thankfully they 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 have a nuke variant in this game is something that we've wanted and it just makes you know going for streaks more enjoyable because before that obviously we had the vicious metal not something i go for brutal metal whatever um same in bo3 they just had metals like i did not enjoy that i enjoy a nuke um something that you know either ends the game or just kills everybody as a score streak but it does it is 25 gun kills so it's like a uh, iw it's like uh bo3's metal you just gotta get gun kills you can't get um you know kill streak kills and stuff like that towards this nuke so the v2 rocket is and something new that's in the game now apparently um you just gotta level up each division prestige it once that's what it says on the leaked notes or whatever at least once for each division and then you somehow unlock it i don't know but it is some coming into the game unless it is already in the game we don't know yet as of right now um but yeah just prestige each division once just to be safe um uh, if not just work on all of them really because i'm gonna end up prestiging all of them four times just to get those free epic variants and stuff like that but uh yeah that'll basically do it hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did drop a like if you guys are new don't forget that subscribe button i'll see you guys in the next video peace